Eva turned on the tap, taken a sip, and thought, wait, why does this smell like rotten eggs? No, your water didn't expire, but there's a reason behind that stink. There's a real science behind that stinky surprise, and yep, it involves bacteria. Stick around because I'm breaking down exactly why your water smells like sulfur, whether it's dangerous and what you can do to fix it. Let's dive in. Let's be honest, smelly water is gross. It ruins your tea, messes with your cooking, and just feels wrong. But here's the deal. That rotten egg smell usually comes from a gas called hydrogen sulfide. It's colorless, flammable, and smells just like spoiled eggs. So where's it coming from? In most cases, sulfur-reducing bacteria are the culprits. These microbes live in places with little to no oxygen, like deep wells, hot water heaters, or old pipes. They breathe in sulfur compounds and release hydrogen sulfide gas as a byproduct. Think of it like this. If normal bacteria are like chefs baking bread, sulfur bacteria are like kids microwaving rotten broccoli. They stink up the whole place. Where is it happening, and why now, depending on where you live, that smell could be happening in a few places? Well water. These systems are especially prone to sulfur bacteria since they draw from underground environments low in oxygen. Hot water heaters, inside your tank. The warm, dark and oxygen-poor conditions make a perfect bacteria Airbnb. Household pipes. If your plumbing is aging or poorly maintained, bacteria can build up in biofilms, Think of it like microbial wallpaper inside your pipes. And here's the kicker. If it only smells when you run hot water, the bacteria are likely in your water heater. Good news, in most cases, hydrogen sulfide in tap water isn't harmful at low levels. But it can corrode metal pipes, stain your fixtures, affect the taste of food and drinks. And if levels are really high, which is rare, it can cause headaches and nausea. Plus, even if the smell isn't toxic, it's a sign that bacteria are active, and we don't want them freeloading in your plumbing. So what can you do if your water smells bad? Here are your action steps. Step 1. Test your water. Use a DIY water test kit or call a lab to check for hydrogen sulfide and sulfur bacteria. Step 2. Flush your water heater. If the smell's only in hot water, drain and flush the tank and consider replacing the anode rod, which may be fueling the bacteria. Step three, install a filter for well systems. Consider filters like activated carbon, aeration systems, or chlorination units that kill odor-causing bacteria. Step four, call a plumber or water expert. If it persists, bring in the pros, especially if you suspect pipe buildup or a more serious plumbing issue. Microbes at work. These bacteria aren't trying to ruin your dinner or your tea. They're just doing what microbes do, breaking down minerals, adapting to low oxygen environments, and thriving in places we forget exist, like our water heaters. They're tiny engineers of the natural world. But hey, sometimes nature needs a little human intervention. So the next time your tap smells like something out of a science experiment, remember, it's not your imagination, it's bacteria, and they're just doing their smelly little jobs. The good news? You've got science, and this channel, on your side. Hit that like button if you've learned something new, tap subscribe to stay microbe smart. Until next time, stay curious, and keep those microbes where you want them.